You should always have a lawyer for a suspended or revoked, meaning DWLS or DWLR case. First and foremost, your lawyer can often strike a plea bargain with the prosecutor that will prevent anything from going on your driving record. This is hugely important if you are currently revoked and ever think about getting your license back because if you are convicted of any moving violation, in other words, even what might otherwise seem like a good plea bargain uh, that wouldn't cause trouble for somebody else will cause someone with a revoked license to have it revoked for an additional one or five years. For people who aren't in that tough situation, you're going to pay additional insurance, you're going to pay the court more money, you're likely to be on probation or at least at risk to be on probation. The Secretary of State can add additional conditions to your license, including suspending it further. As a driver's license lawyer, my job is to go in and make sure that none of that happens, to minimize the consequences as best as possible. As with DUI cases, I always say that success is best measured by what does not happen to you. And my goal in every case is, of course, to not only minimize the consequences to my client, but make sure that down the road, consequences they may never have even thought about never crop up to bite them later on. You can't get that without a lawyer who isn't familiar with the motor vehicle code and doesn't do stuff like this every day, and we do.